Welcome into The Three Show, everybody. Vinny Paraselli with you here in our new offices in Dallas, Texas. Hope you're enjoying the new scenery and my new flat screen. This week on the show, we got a little bit of everything. We got guys advancing to the NHL, we got players committing to college, we got your NA3HL Players of the Month, highlights from yesterday's game, and a few intriguing matchups this weekend to look at. Let's get right into it. Our big story is the commitment, the latter development story coming out of Minot, North Dakota, as Keenan Lund has announced his commitment to Air Force. But before he was a Minotauro, he was a Granite City Lumberjack. During the 2016-17 season, Lund played 45 games and finished with 34 points. The Jacks went on to win the Fraser Cup that year, and Lund was a key contributor, logging 7 points in 10 playoff games. He is now the assistant captain in Minot and is the latest player to go from NA3HL to NAHL to NCAA Division I. Thomas Magnavite of the Cooley Region Chills announced his commitment to St. Mary's University. In just seven games this season, the veteran Ford has 11 goals and 17 points. Magnavite had 44 points in 35 games a year ago and is well on his way to beating that mark this season. In other advancement news, New Ulm Steel forward James Sparagin was called up to the Chippewa Steel this past weekend and played in their 6-0 win on Saturday night. This season, the San Diego, California native has 4 goals and 10 points in 10 games. Mark Fea of the Northeast Generals was called up to the Northeast Generals of the NAHL. Fea has a whopping 43 points in 17 games this season, which makes him well-deserving of this honor, and for his Generals career, he has over 100 points. How about we introduce our Players of the Month for October? The Bauer Ford of the Month is... Mark Fea, we were just telling you about him, how good he was. Well, check this out. In the 10 October games he played, he had eight games in which he had multiple points, and seven of those times, it had three points or more. Hands down, the best player in the league this past month. On the blue line, Cole Olet is the Bauer Defenseman of the Month. In seven games played for the LA Nordiques, the hometown kid had three goals and 14 assists. He was also a plus 21 over that stretch. He saved his best for the last weekend of the month when he had two goals and seven assists in a weekend sweep over in Long Beach. Finally, our Vaughn goaltender of the month is Mikel Fouché of the St. Louis Junior Blues. He made five starts in the month of October and he was 4-1 over that time frame. He allowed just 10 goals to give himself a 1.98 goals against average while also posting a save percentage of 929. One game on the schedule yesterday, Maine and New England getting after it. We were nodded at one after the first, but it's Trevor Arsenal getting his first goal of the season to break the tie. Fast forward toward the end of the period, stars up 3-1 and it's Arsenal again. Have a day kid, two goals for him and two points for New England. Top games of the weekend, we get not one, not two, but three helpings of Cooley Region in St. Louis, a rematch of last year's Fraser Cup semifinals. There might be some bad blood left over from last year's playoffs in March, so you know we're in for some good games. The Junior Blues still remain one point out of first place in that division after splitting with Milwaukee, but the Chill are red hot as they have points in their last seven games. Down to the Bayou we go as the Texas Brahmas and Louisiana Drillers clash in a series that has some major division implications. The Drillers have 23 points and are just three points back of the Mid-City's Junior Stars. Meanwhile, Texas is just a pair of points behind the Drillers. Both teams can really put the puck in the net, so we're expecting a lot of fireworks from this series. That will do it for us here in our new Dallas offices. Be sure to follow the NA3HL on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, or head over to NA3HL.com for the latest news and notes from around the league. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Vinny Paraselli. We'll see you all next week.